Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and in this video, we are going to talk about cold emails. Yes, we have talked a lot about cold calling and now this one is going to be cold emails. I know a lot of guys are unable or like, you know, won't be able to do cold calls, but cold email is something that like you know, anyone can do and you don't have to be good with communication or like you know, have to have the perfect accent to start with the cold email, right? And this is, you can say, a better alternative for cold uh, calling, even though cold calling you will get more responses, but cold email can be uh, better like you know, if you are doing it in bulk. And I'm going to teach you exactly how and what type of email you should be sending to your prospects to convert them into paying customers, all right? And these are some of the responses that we've been getting using our uh, email template that like you know, we have been like you know, using in uh, recently so uh, we have like you know tested out a lot of email templates and we consistent consistently uh, keep using new templates so this one is the one like you know, right now that we are working and you can see we are getting pretty much like you know lots of good responses uh, so you can see like you know this one is show me your program and uh, how much is the program again like you know this is where are you located quality of the appointments prices warranties like in you know, all the inquiries that we are getting after sending the emails yes price like people are showing interest and also asking for the price okay and uh, someone like you know, also wants to uh, hop on a quick zoom call these are like in you know, a few of the responses that we got and there are like in you know, other responses such as such as these and also like you know, we were able to book or schedule appointments like you know very able to call them and even like you know sell them on the phone directly okay so before like you know we dive into the video i'm going to talk about a few things okay uh, what is like you know cold email and what is the perfect strategy you can use to get like you know your prospect to pay you okay and to like you know be your clients all right so Cold email only work if like you know you are sending it in bulk. So like you know, be prepared that you have all the tools ready. And in this video, we're not going to be covering all the tools and everything, but like you know, we'll be covering the perfect template. I know a lot of guys struggle to create their perfect template, so that's what we are going to uh, talk about in this video. Now, like you know, we are going to talk about few things, uh, few points why people fail in their cold email approach. So in this video, we are going to talk about few points on why and how they fail while doing the cold emails okay so there are like a few points which i want to discuss so first is the lack of awareness regarding their target audience so first like you know you have to create a persona okay and in that persona you have to create your perfect audience okay let's say if you are like reaching out to dentists so you would like to reach out to only dentists and not like in you know, a chiropractors or even other businesses because like you know that email is not going to be relevant for them okay second thing is like i know a lot of guys like you know who are new to this new to sending emails like you know they have a small ego okay and they think like you know their emails are looking good and like you know they should be getting responses so you have to do a bunch of tests before coming to a conclusion that okay your emails are working and you don't have to get like you know frustrated if no one is responding because the third point is the third point is i have seen a lot of guys saying like in you know, the product and services are so good like you know that people should start buying it without like you know giving it a second thought so this is also like you know some kind of let's say if you're starting out like you know these are the things that are common occurrence you would think all right like you know why people are not responding your email templates are perfect like you know people should be responding and your services and like you know products are that good that like you know people should buy it anyways okay so these are the things that you have to keep in mind before sending out these emails the fourth thing is going to be not tracking your responses properly okay so let's say like you know if you have five email templates that you are testing out so you have to keep a track of their response or like which email template is getting you the best response what's the response rate also you have to keep a track of the positive as well as the negative response like okay i'm getting positive response uh with you using these email templates so you have to um use those email templates more often so last but not the least is not making enough tweaks or changing the style of your copywriting okay see if a few things are not working you have to make some changes you have to do some tweaks it's same as uh, running facebook ads right if you like you know run, if you're running facebook ads if you see okay your ads are not working so in that case you have to make some changes you have to make some like you know tweaks to your template to your messaging uh, and make sure like you know that people are actually responding either like you know with no or, or yes or or you are not just like you know completely ignored by your prospects okay so these are the, like you know these are the things that uh, i wanted you guys to fix first before like you know looking into this template that we are going to discuss all right 
so this is the formula that I want you guys to stick with and this is the formula that like you know, I want you guys to uh, follow while creating your copywriting or uh, email template okay so this is called like AIDA formula this is also used in uh, copywriting and this is like you know famous email template um, I would say formula so a stands for attention interest desire and action okay so first you want to get their attention because when like you know when people receive an email you would say if you receive an email you can only see the uh, subject and also like you know few i think the first or second line okay so in that subject and also the first and second line you have to catch the attention of your prospect if you are unable to do that in the first one or two lines then like you know people are not going to look at your email they are just like you're know, going to leave it as another spam email okay so you have to get their attention in the first one in the first line also in the subject okay now interest so the second or third line should be for interest uh, you have to give them like you know what interests them like let's say they are running a dental business so how you can help them so whatever like you know, you're going to write as how you can help them that should be the interest point okay let's say we can like you know we can give you 15 to 20 appointments pre-booked appointments on your calendar okay something like that you have to frame your words something like that okay now the desire okay so once like you know you have got their attention they have your interest you have their interest and now it comes to desire okay so they have to once like you know these two things are uh, already like you know taken care of they have to have the desire to look at your let's say email and also like you know have to start thinking about okay i think uh, it should like you know inquire with these guys okay and the last thing is action give them a call to action button so that they can either like you know reply to it or send them like you know send you your their phone numbers or like you know whatever action you can give it to them which is going to be easier for them and then like you know boom you are there you have the perfect email template just follow this template and you will be uh, better off uh, like you're know, getting better replies now in this next slide I'm going to show a perfect email template which we've been using recently this is like you know kind of what we developed uh, uh, by like you know by following a lot of YouTube and like you know by researching a lot and by also like you know doing a lot of tweaks by uh, making like you know I mean doing it for quite some time so once like you know you are doing it for quite some time you will find a perfect email that is like working for you so i'm like you know giving it to you guys uh, and i would like you know you can also make similar changes to your offers or like you know you can use it however you see fit okay so this is going to be high name okay first name always go with the first name not the full name hi let's say paul would you like uh, what would you do with extra 10 to 15 solar appointments each week in Orange County, California? Okay. Or you can also frame it. Uh, we are generating extra 10 to 15 appointments each week in this area. So this is like, you know, going to be area specific. You can like, you know, be state specific. You can be country specific, but like, you know, the more specific you are going to be, the better it will work. Okay. So let's say if you have data of people in that in a in a certain area let's say you have like you know data of people in houston so you can just like you know use that to uh get like you know more attention because i mean if it's local then like you know people are going to definitely like you know they will be uh like they if it's going to be more local people will be willing to look into your emails okay so you can like you know, change the first line and it should be your uh Remember, it should be the first line that should catch attention. So once like, you know, you send this email and which has, let's say, very attentive, high attention rate, people are like, you know, going to open your email. They are going to check it out. And if like, you know, it will interest them, they are going to respond. So now the second line is going to be interest. Okay. So this is how you get their interest. I asked because we are getting 10 to 15 inquiries for residential and commercial solar installations as we currently don't have any solar contract in your area to send them okay so now this is what it is this is uh, interest okay so this is something of their interest and this is like you know what should interest them so we are getting 10 15 inquiries in uh, their areas and we don't have anyone like you know to take these appointments so they will say all right i mean this looks like something that i have to uh, respond to or like you know i might be able to look into now the third is going to be desire so we are working with companies like sunrun power and africa solar uh, who we are like you know, happy to count as our satisfied customer again desire so we are like you know, already established we are working with these customers so i mean like you know you should also work with us or you can work with us and uh, like this is basically like you know what we are we are just like you know making them uh 
safe and secure, like in you know, sound. Okay, we are already working with companies bigger names, so like you know, it should be fine if you are like you know willing to uh, talk to us and see like you know how we do it uh, for you. Okay, reply with a quick yes and your best phone number if you can take these bookings. Again, call to action, but okay, call to action. So call to action, like you know, once you give a call to action. Reply with a quick yes. So you're not asking for much info, but like, you know, you're just asking to see if they're interested. If they say yes, and then like, you know, even let's say if they are sending their phone number, I think that would be even better. Even if they're sending yes, that means like, you, know, you can open a conversation and then like, you know, go ahead with the Zoom call, the meetings, phone meetings, like you know, whatever you can do. And then like, you, know, you can go ahead and close them. All right. So this is like, you know, what we are, we are using and this is like, you know, what working out for us and we have other variations of these emails as well i hope this video is going to help you as much as it did um, i mean this template uh, did to us and it can also like you know, boost your appointment booking rate and also like in you know, closing uh, for your agency hope this video helps and if you like this video uh, don't forget to subscribe all right i will see you in the next one